Thank you. Fear is high at Pershing Middle School in San Carlos after threats were made against some of the students. 10 News reporter Hannah Mullins is live with parents who are worried about their kids who came back to school today from a four-day break. Hannah? And Coach, well, imagine being told your child is on a hit list. That's what one dad told us out here today. Now, the principal did not go into that much detail in these letters, but did confirm another round of threats at yet another local school. You uh, immediately fear for your child's safety. This dad knows a new kind of fear, the fear when a parent learns someone wants to kill his kid. My son's name was on a list. Uh, with a, it was basically a death threat. The Pershing Middle School principal sent parents a letter last week saying a student threatened a number of students on Wednesday and all threatened families were notified. Elisa Lowe hadn't heard and we were there as her daughter explained the hit list. It's hard to like trust that our schools now can take care of them like you would or like you would hope that somebody would. She couldn't help but break down, but that's before she knew the student had been pulled from school, which had an added police presence. And now this dad is teaching lessons that go beyond reading and writing. I did the sit down with him on, uh, you know, what to do if you see some kind of stuff that's not right, if you hear gunfire. And he says he's grateful for the school's reaction. And even though his teen isn't a little boy anymore, he says it's tough to send him off to school. You know, you drop your son off. You you know, we live in a good neighborhood and, you know, you just all, all you can do is, is, is hope and pray every day that, that your child's going to be safe when you, when you, when you uh, drop them off at school. Again, that student no longer attends this school. The principal does say the school is safe and has added police and counselors on campus. Live in San Carlos, Hannah Mullins, 10 News. Hannah, thank you. Today